Hi guys, my name is Dr. Rocker and I know I haven't been most active here on YouTube lately, but I'm so busy drawing all the time. Like Kratos from God of War or Bardock from Dragon Ball, but in a comic book style, of course. Venom, Sub-Zero, some sexy stuff like Power from the Chainsaw Man. Also the Chainsaw Man himself, but in a very muscular manner. And even some fun stuff like this really way too muscular Harry Potter right there. But you can check out all of these on my Instagram page. It's also called Dr. Rocker Art. And for all of these drawings, I show you the in-between steps. So if you want to redraw them, no worries. Just check out the post on my Instagram. But today it's time for another YouTube video. So let's draw Deadpool in pencils only. Let's go! To sketch everything out, I will use my 2B pencil. It's just a regular 0.5 mechanical pencil with a 2B lead and I will use my Strathmore 200 series bristle board. So we have a very fluid movement, but more about pencils and stuff like that you can check out in this video somewhere up there because I will tell you everything you need to know about, about pencils and I get so many questions so about, about this topic. So please check it out. You will have all the answers right there. But now my friends, let's draw! Lane fast, call it high speed. I've been working hard, yeah. I've been working nightly. If you think you'll win, ha, nah, f likely. I be taking shots, yeah, cold blooded, icy. Watching numbers grow is what I call sightseeing. In the front row, run it up when they hype me. The following grows, they know how to ignite me. Call me CEO, I've been running sh right, see. And I'm done with the sketch. As you have been able to see, I had to redraw the hand a couple of times. First I wanted him to, to hold the gun, but then I, I thought it actually would look nice if he would have one of his katanas right there. So I still didn't get it right, which was the reason why I took a photo of my hand. This is also always great for reference, so I invite you to do that as well then it's way easier to come up with a decent drawing. Also a minor change with a big influence was the turning of the head a little bit uh, because this is my sketch. I, I was thinking about uh, drawing him like this but then I thought I would go with this one. Uh, I like the dynamic in the pose although he's just standing still um, and you can see that was, the, that was the first idea with the gun, which I changed up to this one. But the head is a slightly bowed to the side, which made a big difference. And I wanted to have that in my final drawing as well. Other than that, this drawing is straightforward. Just a dude standing there and really, really big, which leaves a lot of room for nice details. Now we will lighten down the whole thing and do all the line weight. So let's go again. And here we go, the light weight is done. Now you can see the whole drawing way better. I will use just one light source in this drawing, which will be about here, which I had to consider even when doing the line weight, especially here, um, when you take a closer look at the stitches from the costume, the light is coming from above and slightly from the left. So the stitches make a bigger shadow here and the line above will be way lighter, of course. You can see it here properly. Other than that, it's quite easy and done very fast. Which brings us to the next step, which will be the strong blacks. I will do those with this pencil. This is an H lead, which means um, it's not as dark as the 2B, but I actually use this because it's less smudging. Because when you do a whole drawing with a 2B pencil, and even the strong blacks, there will be a lot of smudging going on and I want to avoid that and 
yeah it still works out pretty good so we will take this one now and I also prefer a pencil like this this is a, a two millimeter lead because I can hold this in another angle and can, and can go faster this way so let's do some strong blacks And here we go, the strong blacks are done. So Lawrence, do you like the picture so far? Yes. Princess Elsa, do you like the drawing so far? I guess that's a no. As long as there are no horses and pretty girls, it's not for her. But anyway, what about the strong black? You can see there's just one light source coming from here, which, which means there's a shadow uh, this this side of the drawing is way deeper in shadow than this side uh, and you will see that even better when I do the cross hatching. I also used one of these blending sticks to blend those together a bit because it's a big difference. Uh, the whole drawing looks way cleaner and it just takes like three minutes for a whole drawing like this one. And I used one of these gloves so I prevent too much of the smudging. And now I will use my 2B pencil again to do all the cross hatching lines. So have fun watching. God bless you, Lawrence. So have fun watching me doing the cross hatching lines with my 2B pencils now. Let's go! Hey kid, don't ever let them get inside your head. They'll tell you what to do in life instead Of everything you know that you can get Don't let them guide your life towards regret I'll fight for what I love with every breath My past is filled with things I won't forget I use them all to push me to my best So treat the worst of times just like a test If only I could go back in time I'd tell myself that everything will end up alright Okay, so the hatching is done makes it look quite cool already, adds a lot of depth, but still it will be looking way better once we will add some details like wings and folds and stuff like that. So I will grab these two. This is my 2B pencil again and this is a, an eraser. Uh, a very thin one which is very nice to, to erase out all the wings and folds. So let's do that. Even when you feel low, you can still go Even when you feel slow, you can still go Even when there's no hope, you can still go I never answer to no man, I still go Go, 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 Hustle out, hustle every single day And we are done my friends! Another drawing in the bank! I hope you do like it and I hope you enjoyed watching the process of me drawing this one. It's always a lot of fun to draw Deadpool. It's a great character. I can't wait for the third movie where, where we will also be able to see Wolverine again. So this is going to be great. And yeah, if you want to redraw this one, make sure to check out my Instagram account because there you will find all the in-between steps, which is great. Uh, if you want to do a redraw because then you can do that step by step and that is it for today's video my friends make sure to subscribe should you be new to the channel and also turn on the post notification bell so you won't miss out on any of my future videos and tutorials i will also try to go live quite soon so stick around to be able to see me drawing a lot. and since i think that you are an artist and i think you want to become a better one as well as I want to be a better one, uh, make sure to go and watch this video now. That's where I practice along with studies of Jim Lee. If you follow along and draw along with this video, you will learn a lot. Do it a couple of times even and 
you will improve immensely. So see you there my friends, thank you for watching and have a great time drawing.